This is the Panasonic FT7 Rugged Camera. Hi, I'm Johnny and this is Gunther, our Cinema 5D Action Cam Specialist. Gunther, what do you think about this Panasonic? Interesting in any way? Oh, it looks quite interesting actually and interesting enough to take it for a spin on the weekend. Great! Good luck! Good luck! Thanks! Bye! Bye. Gunther, the camera! Oh! So, time for a first summary. This cam is intended to be an outdoor cam. So in order to have a well-known reference, I mounted the Lumix side-by-side -side to my GoPro Hero 6. What becomes obvious is the much tighter field of view of the Lumix. In 4K mode, it crops the field of view to approximately 40mm full-frame equivalent. Also, the optical image stabilization actually fails to deliver any meaningful result on the bike. Slow motion is possible at 100 frames per second in 720p, but without sound. For action scenes, more frames per second are needed. See the same shot from the GoPro Hero 6 at 240 frames per second in full HD. So I decided to turn into a tourist in my hometown Vienna and visit Schloss Schönbrunn. Here the zoom lens is very useful. Unfortunately, the image becomes quite soft at the maximum 128mm focal length setting of the optical zoom. In direct sunlight, it is quite difficult to judge focus in video mode, as the rear LCD is hard to see and the viewfinder is subpar. Hence, you have to rely on the autofocus, which is a bit hit and miss. Also, there are no filter threads on the optics, so you cannot use ND filters to lower the shutter speed and create motion blur. Walking around made me hungry, so I head over to the Landmanns Jausen station. A really useful feature is the macro mode, which lets you focus on subjects as close as 5 cm. The codec, image quality and colors out of the box are really nice. So if you need a reliable, waterproof and sturdy companion on all your endeavors but don't want to carry around a huge amount of gear, this cam could actually be for you. Hey, Gunther, thank you very much for the great review. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.